What's up guys, Press Young here, back for another video. Today Apple released iOS 12.4.8 to the to the public. It's not the public beta, and it's not any developer uh, beta, nothing else. It's the iOS 12.4.8. Now, iOS 12.4.8 is actually give to the uh, older device that doesn't support iOS 13, including the iPad Air, which is the very, very first generation that's come with the A7 process chip. And of course, the iPhone 6, the 6 Plus, and below. The 6 and 6 Plus actually can get iOS 13, 14, but because it only has 1 gig of RAM, so it actually stop at iOS 12. And you can jailbreak if you want to switch it to jailbreak, you can jailbreak the iPad, the iOS 13 and 14. Doesn't matter. Also, those devices who don't support, like they support iOS 12, but they don't support iOS 10, they can update those devices, including iPod Touch, the old generation. And obviously, this the iPad Air is been not smooth because of the it's not running on the A9, this A7. So you go to about it's iOS 12.4.8 and it's 16G201. Now, this information is just say recommended to all users to update those security updates because when you go to your you will do the software security. We didn't, I need to focus it. Sorry. So when you actually, so you go to the latest update. You can see 12.4.8. The update has no published anything entries, which means that it only supports, and you only say security updates only. And it actually supports for all iPhone 5S, 6, 6 Plus, iPad Air, uh, iPhone 2, 2, 3, iPod Touch, means those versions that support all the iOS 12. House and of course, watch OS 5.3.8. I don't know why it disappeared nowhere. I think those series device that doesn't support the watch OS, but let's say you didn't update, but you update this is no problem. Now, of course, iOS 13 in point six also released alongside iPadOS uh, S13.6, but I will do it in the next video. So, after updating, this device is starting to get even better, it means it's already. We turn back to normal, like no more lag, anything. So, which is actually a, a great it for those people who still want to use it forever. But if your battery is not good, you have to keep on charging. But right now, the performance is great. It App Store oh, is loading fast, which is also oh, a good sign. But even it's still a bit slow, but it still goes fast if you can take the time then it's okay there you go it's very fast okay it updates everything is very fast snappy and you can go and update the app like you want to update facebook you want to update it you update it means that instead the circle the circle actually loads and then downloads very fast which is great so this is actually ios 12.4.8 and also comment down below what device you own on the iphone and Obviously, I'll do the next video is iOS 30.6, which I'll upload after when I upload the iOS 12.4.8. At the same time, I'll upload 13.6. 8 means a few minutes later, so you also can check the video as well. Of course, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video.